Hi friends, Mary here. If you're like me, you've been spending this time at home thinking about ways that you can update your home. So today I'm gonna to show you how I plan to fill this space here in my living room with an easy no-sew fabric wall hanging. This is the design that I landed with for my wall hanging. And when I was downstairs, I determined that I want this to be about 18 inches wide, and then I'll make it about 36 inches long. For my fabrics, I've chose this off-white color fabric and then this black yarn dye and yellow for my shapes. So now I'm gonna go ahead and make pattern templates for these shapes. Now that my shapes are cut out, I'm gonna go ahead and trace them onto this fusible web adhesive. This is Wonder Under, but you could also use Heat and Bond. And there's a thin adhesive web on this side of the paper that when I iron it onto my fabric, it'll transfer the adhesive and then allow me to iron my fabric onto my backing piece of fabric. So I'm gonna go ahead and I've grouped my pieces uh, by color and I'm gonna go ahead and just trace around them. So now that these are all traced, I'm gonna go ahead and rough cut around by color and then apply them to my fabric with my iron. And now I'm all set. So I'll go ahead and take these back, cut out my shapes and lay them out on my background. Now that all my shapes are cut out, there's one more thing I need to do before I can apply them. So I need to prep my background for these to go on. Instead of sewing or folding over my edge, I'm just going to tear it and get that nice, like subtle frayed edge. Go ahead, cut here, a little slit to get going, and then my fabric should tear right along the um, grain there. Made a cut just a little bit lower, just since this was cut a little bit off grain the last time I used it. So go ahead. And then I want my banner to be about 18 inches wide. So I'm gonna grab this ruler and make my two snips for 18 inches and then tear vertically. So now I'm gonna take my fabric over to my ironing board, press my edges flat, kinda of clean them up a little bit, pull these loose threads, and then go ahead and apply my shapes. So the paper backing has been removed from all my shapes and I've gotten them laid out exactly how I want them. So now it's time to iron them down. So the last step before we're ready to hang this is to create a pocket across the top for our dowel to go through. So here I am at the top side of my wall hanging and I'm gonna go ahead and apply a half inch piece of my Wonder Under across the top here. So I actually had to use two pieces, just piece together. I'm gonna go ahead and apply that. And then now that that's applied, I want to wrap it around my dowel and find the spot that that needs to be in order for my dowel to fit through. So it's gonna be right around there. And then I'm gonna take my iron and press it right in here. And there she is, our quick and easy no-sew fabric wall hanging. 